So anyway, um, things are <laughs> things are a little strange, and I personally would like to keep my friend Pat out of jail, mm-hmm. but I don't know if that's mm-hmm. possible anymore. No, yeah, I just got a notice on that. Uh, as a matter of fact, if you're speaking specifically of the several tickets I've incurred mm-hmm. in the last now, six months. Now, when you say several, that refers to, that, that means five. That means, well, I've Three. been pulled over eight times. I've received six tickets. Okay, just well, the so, six, though, okay, right? Just, just six. the six. Okay. But it's all, and that's six. only a, a clip of about one one a month. That's a yeah. That's about, yeah, if you rounded it up, yes, <laughs> be about one a month. One a month, okay. But I, I got a notice from the great state of Texas about mm-hmm. what, because we were all concerned that, you know, maybe I'd incurred so many points now that they'd take away my license. And you were hoping, since it was in different municipalities, that uh-huh. it didn't count together. That's what I was hoping. And yet, that's not the case. It does count together. And, are uh, they tracking you, Pat? They are tracking. They you. are tracking Pat. Yes. Oh my gosh! Wow, yes. this is wrong. They specifically targeted me because because <laughs> you're speeding. <laughs> so I was. I little... hate it when they specifically target people mm. for breaking the law. Don't I you? Oh, it's this so is weird. wrong. Man, it's wrong. Anyway, so what so, happened? So they they sent me a notice that mm-hmm. said uh, uh, we n- couldn't help but notice that you've got uh, you're very close to the. <laughs> The six point limit that we it's six. So I don't know if it's if it's oh. one point for every ticket you get, every moving violation. Because two of the tickets I got, one was for seatbelt violation, one was for that having my wrong. one was for having my tire on the line at the intersection. So I don't know if those are half points because they're not moving violations, because I should be there now, but they said I was close. So I'm assuming the next one would put me over. They didn't but give they, you a total? No, they didn't tell me exactly what it was. Go they get just one because I bet it's not. You are very close. Let's see who's right. Go get one. <laughs> no, thank you. <laughs> no, thank ah, you. So wait, what is the result? They're, you're close so to what? What does that mean? I'm close to the six-point limit, which means they don't take away your license. They don't stop you from driving. They give you a surcharge. They charge you, I think it was $125 a year. Well, that's worth it to me. Totally worth it. <laughs> it's worth it to me. Wait a minute. 125 bucks a year. That's and then, it? And then that's it. And then for every ticket you get on that, on top of that, for every point you get on top of that, it's another $25. Well, I can speed from can, now until. I mean, you got to be kidding me. No, I thought, that. thank you. That took a, a load off my shoulders like you no can't kidding. believe. That's great. Wait, so you yeah. can. Here at the beginning of the story, I thought Pat is going to be obeying mm-hmm. the law like nobody's nope. business. Nope. Which he should be doing. I have a new to, zeal for breaking wanted, it. If he, wa- <laughs> if he wanted to make sure that the atonement of Jesus Christ was fully in effect with him. Oh, you're going to bring I, that would, into he it. He would do it, but don't worry about uh, it. Wait a minute. Whoa, 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 whoa. So I thought. The law is. You either stay below this speed or, or you, you pay, pay the fine. fine. If and he's I'm paying his fine, compliant. he's yeah, in right. compliance with fully the law. Compliant. Right. So anyway, <laughs> you explain that one at the bench. Uh, but uh, so so now I'm thinking to myself, that is amazing. Pat is mm-hmm. going to be so uber careful. And I, mm-hmm. I wonder how long that's going to last. Well, I can tell you. What time's the show over? <laughs> yeah, seriously. I mean, only, they just told him a $125 fine. Big deal uh-huh. for him. For a year? If it was a month or something, you, yeah. you'd... Look, you know. uh, you, no one wants to spend more money, give more no, money to the government. But if I could buy a speeding pass for $125 a year, you do uh, it all sign day me up. All well, day you still long. have to pay the ticket. You still have to pay the ticket well, okay, in addition and, to and that. And let's say, you know, let's say that's even... I mean, How much have you spent on tickets? Mm, oh, let's see. They're back to... I, I guess they've probably averaged 200 per at six. That's 1200 bucks. It's a lot, but it's, mm-hmm. uh, you know, by I mean, the end of the year, you'll probably spend breaker. more on saying the president's name. So probably, probably. got 580 under that guy board. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I think there's a, there's an argument here. I would be willing if they could come. Someone needs to pass a bill to give us a speeding pass. Didn't they mm-hmm. do this in Russia, Glenn? This was fantastic. Yeah, they, they worked in the Soviet Union. Did really they really well. do it? Mm-hmm. Well, yeah. I mean, because the, the diplomats could do whatever they wanted. Yeah. Uh, so, so you got a speed. Yeah, you ready for this? I think I told you this earlier today. If you paid a certain fee. Yeah, you could go on a special lane. Oh, I'd do that. Yeah. In a um, second. Yeah, so they gave you special lanes. Uh, in China, this is this is the most amazing thing I've ever heard. In China, you can actually hire a a double for you. If I hired somebody that looked like me, they could go to court, they could be under trial for me, and then they could go and serve my prison term for me. And the court knows it's not you? Mm-hmm. Really? Mm-hmm. For the right price, I'm told. For the right price. To for the right price. These are quality policies. Who for the right price. Who wouldn't do that? <laughs> I mean, if you could find somebody yeah. to do that, of course mm-hmm. you'd pay them to do that. I saw this in an episode of Breaking Bad. They do it with drug dealers all the time. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Really? I mean, at least on TV. Well, if it's in Breaking Bad, you know it's true. It's a documentary. Yeah. Mm-hmm. What's Breaking Bad? 
It's a TV. TV, I mean, some TV would say it's a, it's a drama TV show. Others would say it's a documentary, and that's the one I choose to believe, even though it's <laughs> blatantly not true because the guy from Malcolm in the Middle is in it. But other than that, I don't think he's in documentaries. We don't know what he, which role was he acting as Malcolm in the Middle's dad, or is he acting as a drug dealer? We don't know. You we don't know, know one no. of them is true. Don't we don't know. know. We don't know who to trust anymore. Mm-hmm. Which, by the way, brings me to our uh, 